Hi friends! I thought we could do a little art project based on the book that we read earlier, our, When Your Llama Needs a Haircut, and how it's really silly when he's looking at all the different haircuts that he might have. And I thought it might be kind of fun to do a little face and then give it hair of whatever kind you want. So think about some of these cute ideas or whatever ideas you have at home. So moms and dads, what you need, I tried to keep it things that you might have at home. So just a piece of paper, any kind of paper, um, and then maybe some hair ingredients like yarn, um, strips of paper that you could use. I have some pipe cleaners here. You could use even just crayons, markers, paint. Um, if you have cotton balls or macaroni or puff balls, I've got a box of, I don't know, I've got a box of puff balls. Anything that you have that could be really silly hair. So, then moms and dads, what I'm gonna have you do is take a plate. I have kind of a wonky shaped plate because I'm just gonna make it wonky. And I'm just going to trace it. You could also freehand draw a circle. Does not matter. That is gonna be your vice. Here you go. So just make a face like this. No big deal. Very simple with things you have. Then you wanna draw, draw some eyes and your have your child draw eyes or you can cut pieces of paper out into an eye shape. You can, if you have white paper, you can color it black and then just put the eyes on or you can draw eyes. Just for the purpose of this, I'm just gonna draw eyes. They are not fancy, I'm gonna warn you. But it's kind of fun to give kids um, just paper eyes and then they can glue them on because sometimes they put them in really interesting spots and that's kind of funny and adorable. So I'm just going to make a little face with a nose and a big happy face. And if you're, let's see, super simple, really, really simple, you, you might draw some ears on. And again, if you have paper, um, my suggestion would be to cut out the shapes, like cut out shapes for an eyes, cut out a little nose shape, maybe a little mouth shape, and maybe some little ear shapes, you know, something, anything kind of like this. And then have them glue it on a piece of paper because that's, it's, like I said, it's really, really fun. And then simply take whatever it is that you have decided to be your silly hair and just glue it or tape it or whatever onto your picture and I'm literally doing this just kind of on the fly here but oh rainbow hair it is so if I were to tape this on this is what you'd get and there's my person with crazy rainbow hair. And like I said, again, use macaroni or or whatever. If I were to want to use like just some, some yarn, I could just take a wad of yarn and glue it on there. And then I have a different face. You could also leave it blank like this and have your child play with different objects. Like what would it look like if I had just a little curl in the middle of my forehead. It was pink and they can just sort of play with it like that or you can glue it on. What would it look like if I had paper clips for hair? That would be ridiculous. I may have to move my phone. There's I don't know, how am I doing it? Paper clip. Hmm. No. Anyway. Paper clips. Paper clips for hair. Yeah. It could be 